Hello and welcome to another edition of SmackDown. I'm Michael Cole along with Taz and partner. The locker room is still buzzing about that attack by John Cena and the Big Show on some top Raw superstars last week. And can you believe that the board of directors has sanctioned a cross-brand grudge match for this Sunday at SummerSlam? But that's not all, Cole. Some of those Raw superstars have said they're going to show up here tonight to get some payback. Wait, wait, is that, is that... Is that Triple H and Flair in the ring right now? I, uh, am the game. Woo! And tonight, uh, I'm coming to SmackDown, uh, to find the guys who kicked my ass, uh, and made my father, the nature boy, cry like a little girl. Say, uh, Nature, uh, why do they still call you the Nature Boy, huh? Aren't you about 90? Maybe they should call you Father Time. <laughs> but seriously, yo, no one can say that SmackDown didn't make an impact on Raw last Monday. We did just what we wanted to, and that was punk out the best that they got. Let's see now. 10 for Triple H. <laughs> 16 for Flair. Raw is never going to forget the day SmackDown took out 26 world champions in one shot. And now we're supposed to be scared? Because Triple H is leading a posse to SmackDown? Please. He shows up here, he's gonna get more of the same. They can't see me. They're here! The Raw Superstars are here! Here we go. This is gonna be a rocket buster. It whenever a superstar decides to cheat to win rather than compete fairly. Well, it looks like they're slowing the pace down a little bit here. That might not be such a good move in my opinion. Oh, come on. You just can't keep going non-stop. That's a good way to wear yourself out and make a critical mistake. No, but you can't give the opponent any time to recover, neither. You gotta stay on them and wear them down. But what about picking your spot? If you try to execute a badly timed move just because you want to stay on offense, that could have a disastrous result. I'll tell you what, Paul. Let me talk about what it's like to be in a match like this, and you can cover what it's like to whiten your teeth. Deal? And there's the reversal. Look at these fans. They didn't like that one bit. Yeah, well, you know what? I got some bad news for these fans. He don't give a damn what you think. Seems like things have quieted down a little bit here. I think this may just be the calm before the storm, Taz. Triple H is the man, Cole. I've been in the ring with this dude, and I'm not ashamed to say he took me to limits, and he got the victory. I got a lot of respect for anyone who could pull that one off. Wait a second. He dodged that bullet. The, I think someone's looking for a weapon here, Cole. Anyone who thinks that's 
not what the chair was meant to be used for. Why do they keep so many dangerous weapons under the ring? Those things can cause serious injuries. Listen to me, Cole. Getting hit by that thing's even worse than it looks. I certainly don't envy the referee in this match. No kidding. There's only one thing that a 2x4 wrapped in barbed wire is good for, and it's not gone. I don't think there's any superstars on the roster who wouldn't love to have... Ha! Ah, that's the way to do it. Grab a weapon from under the ring and start... Oh my god! A 2x4 wrapped in barbed wire. Let me tell you something, I felt that before. Look at these superstars go. It's obvious they've done their homework on each other. Will somebody please take that barbed wire wrapped 2x4 from him? All right, time to see what kind of toys we're gonna... Come on! That's a 2x4 wrapped in barbed wire! This has got to stop! Looks like he's decided to grab a weapon from... Look at this, Cole! He's going for it! And there it is! The pedigree! He's taking his opponent to school with that 2x4 wrapped One, in barbed wire. Two. The referee's hand was coming down for a three count. If he keeps connecting with that chair, this is going to be a real short match. The conditions are right for a finishing move. I was afraid it was only a matter of time before he did something like that. Hey, it's like they say, Cole, if you're not cheating, you're not trying. <laughs> John Cena has nice quick counter. What kind of sick, twisted person would just leave a 2x4 wrapped in barbed wire laying around? I don't know if this is such a good move. This could be disastrous. I saw some pretty nasty stuff on the ring earlier, Cole. Well, if no one gets that 2x4 away from him, this one's going to be over real quick. These superstars are beating the living hell out of each other, and these fans are eating it up. Someone had better get that 2x4 away from him. He likes fighting dirty, and it's easy to see why. He's pretty good at it. He certainly is. My God, he's not doing his opponent any favors with that ring bell. There's a lot of things under the ring, and all of them hurt. There's the submission hold. He's using that ring bell as a weapon. Superstars are pounding. Wow! Nice shot from that ring bell. I think that if one of these superstars successfully executes their finishing move, this one is over. That ain't necessarily the case, Cole. Just because it's called a finisher. Well, if they didn't want him using the chair like that, they should have left it lying around. What an incredible! Oh my God! That two by four could inflict a serious injury here. Ladies and gentlemen, we are seeing an incredible display of athletic ability here tonight. What do you expect, Cole? These are WWE superstars for crying out loud. Look at this, Taz. This could be it. Good night, Irene. Nobody sticks around long after taking a finisher Ooh. like that. Folks will be staying with us.
this match to the end with no commercial interruptions. Good thing too, Cole, because I don't think we'd ever hear the end of it if we put Ooh. away here. You're probably right, Taz. I know I wouldn't want to miss a second of this action. It's crazy to think we actually get paid to do a job like this. There's thousands of people out there who would do this for free. Really? Maybe I... This could be free right here. One, two... I think it's only a... Wow, they don't get much closer than that. Look at this, Cole. Look at this. Oh, my God. There's a reason that's called a finishing move. The match usually doesn't go much longer. This guy made a sickening impact from that steel chair. I knew it was only a matter of time before we saw that. I don't like it. Well, someone's head wide open with that ring belt. Look at this. Could it be? You're damn right it is, Cole. And that's a heck of a finisher right there. On the mat. Shoulders One, down. This could be two, it. Three. This capacity. I'm not sure if everyone's going to be happy about it, but this one is in the books. Here are your winners. Triple H. Yeah. <laughs>